Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing Schlink in Docker. So to get started, let's log into the host that's going to be running Docker. Then we'll use apt install to install some prerequisite packages required by Docker. Then we'll install the Docker GPG key and add the Docker apt repository. Then we'll use apt install again to install Docker, Docker Compose, and Container D. With everything installed, we'll make sure the Docker service is running. Add the current user to the Docker group and re-authenticate the current user. Now we have Docker installed and running. We'll create some working directories for Schlink and MariaDB. We'll set the ownership of the new working directories. Then use the docker run command to start a MariaDB container. Next we'll use docker run to start the Schlink backend container. And finally, docker run to start the Schlink web frontend container. We'll use docker exec to generate a new Schlink API key. Copy the API key to your clipboard to use in just a minute. Then open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the docker host, colon 8888. Click the add a server button. Give the new Schlink server a name, paste the URL, and paste in the API key generated from the docker exec command. Then click create server. Welcome to Schlink URL shortener running in Docker. 